Hey everyone, so I'm gonna do an unboxing of this EVGA 120mm uh, FX12 fan that I got on sale on eBay for just 5 bucks. Seriously, just 5 bucks like a few days ago it was on sale on eBay. Uh, and yeah, this EVGA fan is basically what they include in their CLC AIO liquid coolers. So it's the one with the really unique curved frame. And I'm gonna be testing this uh, to compare against my other fans, like in my fan review roundup. And I guess we shall see how it performs compared to the other fans. But yeah, here's the EVGA box itself. It's quite simple. Here's the specifications and features and whatnot. So 2400 RPM which is quite fast, so I don't really understand why they call it a quiet 120mm fan because trust me, this is not going to be a quiet fan. If you're looking for a quiet fan, look somewhere else, like a lower RPM fan. Although this can certainly be quietened down if you slow it down using the PWM function. But for now, let's just take a look inside, see what the fan is, and maybe we can test it out at maximum speed. So inside you get this like Molex 2 and 4 pin power adapter if you want to run it straight straight to like 12 volts for some reason but pretty sure no one does that also you got these like rubber pads that you're apparently supposed to put on yourself so I don't understand why I didn't get that you should have just put these on the factory seriously and you got these like 4 uh, typical self tapping uh, screws for fans and you got the fan itself so this is what I'm talking about. The fan frame is really weird. It's almost like the fan is kind of frameless because, you know, the frame doesn't really like go around the blades. Like it curves downward under the blades all around. And, you know, see, you can see the gap like from the side to the frame. Like on most fans, when you do a camera angle of this like camera angle, you wouldn't be able to see through uh, a gap from the blades but because of the like slope down uh, frame design and also like the cutout you can you can do that with this fan so it's kind of a unique design and at first when I saw this fan design in their AIOs I was really skeptical because you know this kind of frame design that means that a lot of air can like leak out of the sides because of like the cutout and stuff and not be all like forced onto the radiator but apparently that's their goal because you know, on their website, they say that they make it quieter because of the fan frame, because it doesn't completely envelop the fan. So I guess it reduces turbulence because, you know, if it hits the radiator, you know, the air that's coming off the fan, it'll just bounce back and go out the sides. So that's why I think that it might reduce static pressure. So I thought that this wouldn't work very well, but I've seen the reviews of the AIOs and apparently these fans work pretty good. So I'm looking forward to testing it. but. You know, for now, let's just do the unboxing and like product tour. So my first impression was like, this is really flimsy. Like <laughs> it's super bendy. You know, the frame doesn't feel very high quality to me. It's super bendy, but it's probably because the fan struts are super thin. Like you can see it can bend and also like the frame is super thin so you can easily bend it. But you know, if there, this might be for aerodynamic reasons, you know, the strut. But the frame is really because of their weird design that it's not strong because they basically just chopped off a part of it. So it's, yeah, it's quite bendy. It's not a very high quality feeling fan. But we'll see if the performance speaks for itself. But for now, let's just test it out and see how it sounds and like how does the air movement feel like at full speed. So here we go. And I would say on like my first impression, it is pretty much surprisingly quiet, you know. I wasn't expecting it to be this quiet because this is actually quite a quiet fan for 2400 RPM. Uh, just take a listen. I really expected this fan to be louder in this, but yeah, it's actually quite a quiet fan for 2400 RPM. So I guess that it's kind of right, but it's not quiet though. It's totally not quiet, but for 2400 RPM fan, this is quite a quiet fan. But you can certainly hear it compared to quiet, like real quiet fans, because you know, 
it moves a lot of air it actually does move a lot of air um, like it's it's actually quite strong but one thing is that it kind of like slightly vibrates so more so than the higher quality fans that I've touched before when running at full speed and I think partly is because of the EVGA logo uh, hub like in my opinion because that must be like slightly off balance but maybe also because Yeah, it kind of vibrates a little bit, but it's not that big of a deal. Although, if you put it on the table, like you can hear that it makes more noise because it does vibrate a little bit. But it does blow a lot of air. So, I think um, that's set for the testing it on. And, you know, I mean, the fan blade design is quite typical. Well, it's not typical, but, you know, it's typical of a high static pressure design, which is like a uh, low angle. So it's really like swooped around. It's not a very steep angle. So it does, it should create a lot of pressure. But yeah, it's similar to their like ACX, ACX GPU fan design really. Like it's kind of swept back, which is kind of odd, you know, because this would really make the air kind of like spread out more than it's concentrated. But yeah, that's what they're going for. I guess we'll see in the performance testing. But for now, you know, the first impression is it does look kind of cool. And you know it does have black cables and everything but it is kind of a weird design approach so i guess we'll see in a performance testing like i said but for now thank you for watching hope you enjoyed this video and if you do please leave a like and please click subscribe to see more of my future videos thanks for watching